Well, I, I want to try this again about President Obama's reluctance to, to, to fire people because I know you and I have talked about this before. I, I, we've, back in when I covered uh, Obama in 2008, he, he hates the Washington game. And I'm sure to a degree he's watching mm -hmm. this all play out like a Washington game. Scandal, a bunch of Republicans call for somebody's head, uh, then Democrats who are vulnerable call for somebody's head, then other people chime in, the media start. And I'm sure he sees this to a degree through that lens. But doesn't that also prevent him from looking at this from the perspective of there is a serious problem here, the problem has been going on for years, and maybe this guy, even if he's the victim of this silly Washington game, maybe this guy actually isn't the best guy to be uh, heading up this department. I actually think that the president looks at the problem first and just sees that there's some noise around it. I think that the president is dedicated to fixing what he thinks is a serious problem. He's been talking about this since the days that he was a candidate for the United States Senate, not just since he was running for president and since he became president. He thinks that the problems are serious. Now that we've uncovered these new ones, he wants to have the right folks in place in order to fix it. And just imagine, Jake, if the president were to just fire Shinseki, it's not like Senate Republicans are going to let you... Uh, put some new head of the VA, VA in um, to deal with the problem, they're going to, you know, uh, extract their pound of flesh and they're going to make it as difficult as possible for him. So for the